uh, almost everyone is bored seems however uh, i'll start my presentation without further more delay so i am uh, shaham ajwat uh, completed my degrees in biological science and masters in plant sciences and uh, going with my phd is in uh, tissue culture cell culturing where it is totally related to plants so though uh, i always uh, take scientific topics and seriously guys i am not that aesthetic you might observe my slides that's not the aesthetic you know i just i have written whatever thing and uh, during the presentation shall i will be asking some questions as well so my topic is something complicated individual effects on global climatic changes can we influence can we influence Uh, can we influence oh you can hear right <laughs> okay <laughs> can we influence in the global climatic change so it's something very very serious question climatic change is a thing happening for years and years 20 30 30 now it is 150 years the global temperature in 1850s is 0 degree celsius and today it is 14 degree celsius so it is happening for years and years every country is contributing as Muhammad said initially Iraq is contributing not only Iraq US contributes UK contributes how individual can affect that's something a good question right can we make a change by a small thing what we do here right okay okay i i sort out the problem i sort out the problem right fine so um a typical boring question what is climatic change climate change refers to long term shifts in temperature and weather patterns a very important thing uh, do you know that in the recent past you are, how many of you are living in jidda yeah you had a good rain right is it a good thing no saudi be saudi being desert is ecologically defined there are so many species which is recognized and limited to your region if the rainfall increase those species will die do you know that i think uh, usama you asked me a question right you asked me once uh, uh, why what is your main plant why wheat is not success in your region do you know that if wheat won't grow it require a temperature of 40 degrees celsius for the fertilization so 40 degrees celsius is favorable for who for that specific plant so the climate how it was previously should maintain then only the climate will be protecting the species so today that's why i just went through the news today in colombo they have put a meme in the facebook this is sun this is earth and colombo is in the middle what does it mean colombo is having a very high weather a very hot weather so being when something happened and the usual pattern has to be maintained so climate change climate mean it is a long term shifts in temperature and weather patterns so it's significant variation in average weather condition becoming warmer wetter drier over several decades so a dry country should remain dry a wet country should remain wet if they change we will lose lo lose millions of species we we'll lose millions of species right so does islam talk about climate yes there are a lot that's a misconception that you know we muslims are the least people using islam or quran for the scientific purposes but we proudly say once someone invent something based on quran this is invented using quran right but we are not using the quran for inventions but i just go through these points quran and climate he is the one who sends the wind assuring in his mercy when they bear heavy clouds look it shows it says the reason how the rain happened the rain what fall on saudi is not the clouds of saudi it came because of a wind why wind is happening again there's a reason okay we dry them to lifeless land and then cause rain to fall producing every type of fruit similarly we will bring death to life perhaps will be mindful so the same idea this verse shows how the climate is being changed sing the verse and we made the sky protected ceiling but they from its sign are turning away this is basically mentioned about the ozone layer which is in the quran and do not spread corruption and the land after has been in order set in order come on this word set in order says the environmental equilibrium and call upon him and hope here indeed allah mercy and always uh, close to the good doers 
So in simple, and hadith on climate, so this is very, very famous hadith on climate. The hour will not begin until the land of Arabs once again become meadows and rivers. So here I have a serious question. Even I went through this. So once again means previously it has been what? It has been a blessed area, right? Now it is desert because of a climatic change again. Fine. So, and this one, uh, I'll come to this point finally, right? Uh, why? So, what are the witnesses of climatic changes? As I said, Saudi Arabia is a good example. Sri Lanka is losing the rain. At the same time, Saudi is gaining rain. So, some change is happening in the world wide. It is not the easy thing, right? So, Saudi Arabia has a record with 31.8 m average rainfall in the April 2023, highest in 40 years. The analysis reveals that the annual rainfall decreasing significant 90%, but what is there? While increase in the most recent decade. So, that's something very much uh, significant that shows that the climate is changing in the upcoming future. And ill effects of climatic change, I'll go through very fast. So, heat waves. Uh, flow of highly temperate air from one region to another. This is happening because of global warming. So all the causes what I am talking is basically because of global, global warming. Extinction of biodiversity, as I said to you about the uh, several species. For example, if you look after some amphibians, amphibians require some temperature to fertilize. So if they are not fertilizing, they will never reproduce. They will never reproduce means they can't go forward in their life. So extinction happening because of, again, Global warming and the acid rain. Also, intense drought. So, intense drought might be common here, but uh, countries, tropical countries like Sri Lanka and Malaysia, nowadays they are facing this problem. Intense drought means that uh, uneven distribution of rain, what was predicted previously, is not there now. And uh, melting glaciers. So, come on, just say me, what are the points of melting glaciers? What would happen if glaciers melt? The water amount will increase. The ocean water amount increases, the countries like Maldives will sink down. So it is a global problem at all. And warming ocean, even the warming ocean has a problem that when the ocean gets warm, the water expand and water expansion will cause again the countries which is lower to sink down. And in general, the cause for all this problem is none other than global warming. I'm coming to the point now itself, right? So, global warming is influenced by increase in greenhouse gases. So, greenhouse gases, you know, right? You people are great 10 girls. Oh, what is greenhouse gas? Greenhouse gas. No idea. Okay. So, greenhouse gases mean basically the gases which capture the heat and release it to the environment. Except O2, H2, Cl2, F2. All the other gases are considered to be what? Greenhouse gases. When greenhouse gases in, in increase in the environment, the temperature will be automatically increased. So that is what happening globally. We call it global warming. 70% of global warming is because of carbon dioxide. Here, we are going to consider only about carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide released to the environment by several ways only be removed by one and only way. Come on, I asked once in a lecture from a student how to reduce carbon dioxide releasing to the environment. That student thought a while and said, we'll kill people. And I asked, why killing people? Now, when, we people we, when we kill people, they're not going to breathe, carbon dioxide will never go out. So I was thinking, yeah, that, nothing to argue, right? Come on, what you can do? Any other option to reduce carbon dioxide? Ca very good. Caption CO2, okay, okay. Yes, yeah. relates to the rain. Very good one. So, what we can do is increase CO2 fixing. Fixing means capturing from the environment and fixing. Second thing, decrease CO2 emission. So, decrease CO2 emission is done by several countries, several summits. It's really hard to make it up. It's not easy. Decreasing CO2 emitting is a very common thing. For example, if they say, what to do? We, we, we can't ride vehicles. We can't go with flights. We have to stop everything. But we are not considering on this point, CO2 fixing. Why we can't fix CO2? Why, why we can't fix CO2? The only way is what? Just photosynthesis, simple. The project idea what I give is very simply, plant trees and maintain trees. That's what I give, plant trees and maintain trees. I don't expect this type of plant, plantation. This is not my expectation. 
this is basically my expectation i i i, I expect that mean plant and tree house by house everyone personally to do it so project proposal for interaction international tree planting and maintaining activity through digital platforms uh, so this is one of the very famous narrative from sallallahu alaihi wasallam even the resurrection was to be that mean even tomorrow is the day of judgment or the day of resurrection plant a tree even your tauba will not be accepted but if sallallahu alaihi wasallam recommend to plant a tree that mean in some cases it's been greater than that so so you initiate tree planting among international youth committee to increase carbon dioxide fixing which contribute to the global climate change so in the first phase initial countries with representation you can initiate in your place just through, through whatsapp groups not not we have i'm not going for heavy budgets at once okay and selecting most suitable plant to be planted in their region you know coconut tree is okay for sri lanka but not for pakistan so in their region we have to implement their idea creating a target of trees to be planted 100 trees at the first year okay fine distribution of plants in their specific region collecting data on specific plant to time consulting the challenges what are the challenges are they growing or not whatever thing and phase 2 stabilizing the combined established country we, we stabilizing the well, if, we, if we implement in five countries we stabilize in the second way developing a website to get consult from the plant experts third method to review the grown plant we have to create a method to be can be an app or somehow what are the, whatever thing so if we are doing you can consult and ask this 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 is how i can what how can solve it out you can come up with ideas and recruiting more volunteers in country tree planting in the schools and the younger generation we can do phase the expanding initiative campaign different countries can fix a target developing an app every day we can give the ideas please do do this do not to do that there is a method to review grown plant there is a method to distribute the cultivation now it can make it also benefit sometime so selecting best planters globe when you recognize them holding why we this international summit for tree planting blah blah we can develop them into various several ideas so the budget is very simple initially volunteers and some plants were taken but what's a group of free and marketing cost is there that's what we have to do and that's it that's my idea you can ask the questions and i'm sahamad you are right yeah you may ask the questions right, right.